don't even have line claims in game yet, but CIG is releasing the biggest troll mechanic for 315. Hopefully, law and some form of shielding is released before we finally have the ability to use our land claims. Hello, YouTubers. This is Anubifire. On the 30th of September, CIG posted Inside Star Citizen, Bombs, Bombs, and More Bombs, where we got a chance to hear from Richard Tower, who is lead game designer. Here's what you need to know about the show. Richard wants to have a real reason to have defend attack game loops. Bombs can push through player or NPC defenses to soften the target up, ready for a follow-up attack. Big ship, big size 10 bomb, no guidance, but it does have the ability to aim. We now have a new bomb UI, which is kind of like missile operator mode, but it's bomb operator mode if a bomb is selected. The circles represent the perfect release alignment, and they plan to add a remote camera plus a full bombing suite resulting in a situation where the pilot and the bombardier need to work together which I like, that sounds like fun. That kinetic kill is deliberate and large, but even if you're just near, you'll probably take a little bit of damage from the shockwave. Jared wanted to do a segment on the A2 with some shots about it and others in a patch report. I just did a report on the EVO leaks, so here's a point on point list of what you might see in 315. Medical healing, down states, injury states, treatment, hospitals, local player and vehicle inventory, a new app for the Moby Glass, loot generation, new missions, the A2, bombs, the Ion, the Redeemer, Arena Commander got a polish for Broken Moon, and new polish for Orison. That's about it. Thank you very much for spending your time with me. Fly safe and I'll see you in the verse.